Now we are on question number five. Let's read the question. The following question uses a robot in a grid of squares. The robot is represented as a triangle, which is initially in the bottom, bottom left square of the grid and facing right. So here is our robot and it faces right. Consider the following code segment, which moves the robot in the grid. So we have to apply this on the robot. So we have to uh, understand what the algorithm tells us. And at the end, we are supposed to find the final position of the robot. So it says which of the following shows the location of the robot after running the code segment. So let's read the code segment. Right here it says n equals 3. This is the initial value of n. And we have to repeat three times. What we have to repeat will be this whole thing. So we have to repeat three times this area and we repeat n times move forward and then rotate left n equals n minus 1 so let's start so at the end we have to repeat three times that's what we know first second and the third time and we have to note what our n value is so n so our initial n value will be 3 n is 3 so repeat 3 times move forward and then rotate left so we have to repeat 3 times move forward 1 2 3 and then rotate left it'll look up And then it says n equals n minus 1, which means decrease n by 1. So n becomes 2. And we go up again, because we have to repeat 3 times. We repeat n times. n is 2. Move forward, which means move forward twice. And then rotate left. So let's go up. Move forward twice. 1, 2 and then rotate left. So we are done with the second iteration and we are on the third iteration. At the end of the second iteration, n will be n minus 1, which is 2 minus 1, 1. So repeat one time, move forward, then rotate left. Repeat, move forward once and then rotate left which is this position so we are done with the program and let's see which one gives you this answer whichever is in the middle of, uh, of the grid line and then looking down will be the answer as you see the answer will be A this is the answer choice. A is the answer. So, we are done for this question. If you have any question, please leave a comment. Thank you for listening.